growing up in Uvalde, it was very peaceful. I grew up with my family out here, so we were always having get-togethers. Kind of never inside it, we were more outside type of people. What I do notice out here in the Uvalde Estates, uh, a bunch of people get together outside. So the first impression is, I think it looks, the house looks really set down and put down. It looks secure. <laughs> It looks really nice. I didn't expect it to look as nice as it does, uh, but it made a huge difference. I feel like the house looks more sleek, it looks more clean, it looks more set down. Uh, my grandparents ended up selling this corner piece, and then they sold it to a second cousin of ours, and then my brother started looking for a home, so then they, my brother ended up buying it back. So we grew up there and there, there used to be a trail here and we used to come over here and play with our cousins. You know, my dad actually lived, we lived there. Yeah, he got cancer and then he, well, he couldn't afford the double wide anymore so we moved into a single wide. And then after he passed, the single wide kind of needed work and my mom couldn't afford so we moved. When they bought the property, uh, well my second cousins, they ended up bringing this, um, the double wide in. And then they ended up selling it so then my brother bought the property with the double wide. This tree actually was like a very, I need to take care of that tree. I'm, I'm planning on like, you know, fixing it up, but we used to play on that tree when we were little. We would call it the Diaz tree. Yeah, so it's just like full circle now that we're all here, that me and my brother are here. And our plan is to get my mom to come out here. I mean, just to stick a, maybe a mobile home back there or something, but I love being out here just because we grew up here. This is our dirt, you know? Yeah, so it's my brother, me, my, my uncle, my grandparents, and then my aunt. They own some of that land too. Yeah. yeah, they own five acres. So I think up until a little bit past the, the two-story house. Yeah, it was pretty fairly quick. Um, I think Tanner more or less knew how much I wanted to give down and stuff like that. And, and I kind of had everything done because I was almost going to buy for, uh, with another company and that company kind of was just like, I don't know, it, it didn't feel right, you know? And then as soon as I got with Tanner, he just, I don't know if Tanner's vibes or just like, you know, Broston, everything, everything just like clicked really quick with you guys and the process went by really fast. And then you guys were really good at reaching back out to me with any questions or concerns that I had. I remember calling you guys like, what about this, what about that? And you guys would get it answered real quick or y'all would give me an answer within the next day or something like that. 